I'll watch video. The standard has been set by the TV. Now the video, when you drop a packet, the video quality is bad. You have a misplaced head. You have a, the audio sound is twisted. Think about millions of people trying to consume this content. Simultaneously, that's compounding the problem. It's difficult to gauge the demand for a live event. Um, and uh, to be able to figure out uh, how many, what type of resources one needs to throw at it in order to make that quality good. You tend to either overbuy or underbuy, um, and a lot of things can go wrong with the live value chain. Well, we bring the best of TV, certainly quality. 24 by 7, always works. But Centon will bring the best of the internet, which it is interactivity, richness, and reach. It's really not just about the quality, but it's also about the ability to control the broadcast. When you talk about the ability to have two second updates on a viewer down to the viewer level, now you see, and the broadcasters see, that they can do a broadcast that they can't even do on terrestrial. most importantly, you extend the reach of the content owner or the broadcaster down to the viewer in a way that they've never been able to before, from a contact perspective, from a reporting perspective, but also an interactivity, so that now there's a two-way conversation rather than a one-way signal. What live really enables is interactivity. Now that content can be monetized for audiences globally that want that content. So we are making the link between that content that is perishable and the consumer who wants it. You know, we are at the very beginning of a huge revolution. I think the live experience of the future involve uh, multiple cameras, user controlled, uh, the ability to share that video experience with other people in real time. They can deliver things like chat, they can deliver multiple camera angles, things that empower the viewer in the broadcast world so that now it's very compelling from the viewer side, it's very, very compelling from the broadcast side. We really only uh, hit the tip of the iceberg with what's possible with interactive media and video. We'll bring the world together like we have never seen before. I dream of the day that when I see France and Germany playing together, I see two countries uniting and will facilitate that united experience for the world.